Hi, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com and today I want to share with you a fall corn math activity. You'll need to have this pattern which can be found on my website at ChildCareLand.com underneath the video section and you print it out on cardstock paper and laminate. You also need to have these uh, markers which is also uh, with the patterns. And besides that, you need to have some kind of a die and you can use the ones with the number dots on them or the, tradi or the traditional dots or the ones with numbers on. You don't have to have dice that look like this. You can use your own dice from a, a board game. You could make your own. But I found these on um, at my local educational school supply store, but you can find these online as well at some of the online school supply stores. But again, you don't have to use these kind. You use whatever kind that you have readily available for you. What you would do with this activity is you'd have this mat sitting out along with the markers and then a die and the child would roll the die and whatever number's on here, they would block off on here. They'd have to find that number on here. So this was a five. And so they need to find a five on here and cover that up with a marker. And then they would roll again until all of the numbers have been covered on the fall corn. This is, um, and if they roll one that's already uh, not on here, they would just roll again. This is numbers one through six, but I have also included a pattern that does not have any numbers on it in case you would want to create your own numbers on there. And you could do that, uh, for example, for using um, two dice together and the children would roll the dice and they add the numbers as on the dice together and then find the number on here. Or they could also do a subtraction activity with that. So it's up to you whether you want to use numbers one through six and just one, or maybe double up the dice and use a blank pattern and fill in your own numbers. But again, play would just continue until um, the numbers have all been filled up on the fall chord. This is an excellent number. Um, recognition activity, a one-to-one -one correspondence activity, and again, if you choose to use a blank pattern, you could make it into a um, addition and subtraction activity as well. For a fall corn math activity, I'm Shelley Levette with ChildCareLand.com, and thanks for watching.